Hi! In a previous video, you learned about the IGD strategy for dealing with new vocabulary in a news article. Remember, that's Ignore Guess Dictionary. In this video, we will focus on the second part of that strategy, guessing. We will talk about how to use a new word's roots and prefixes to guess its meaning. First, what is a root? Think of a tree. Below the ground are roots, and many branches grow up from the roots. When we talk about vocabulary, we can see that many different words share the same root. For example, let's think about words like position, pose, compose, composer, opponent. These words all share the root pose or pwn, which both come from a Latin root word meaning to put or to place. So all of these words are related to putting or placing. Your position at work is your place in the organization. A dancer's pose describes how she places her body. A composer puts different sounds together to make music. When you play chess, your opponent is the person who is placed across from you. From one root, the English language has developed many different words with related meanings. Another example is the root port. You may know the words transportation, export, and import. These words all come from the Latin root portare, which means to carry. So transportation is about carrying people and things across long distances. A country's exports are the products that are carried out of the country. And the products that are carried in are called imports. So we've talked about two roots and the different words that use them. There is another important part in most of the words we just looked at, the small part that comes before the root, like trans, com, and x. These are called prefixes. They also come from Latin and always come before the root. They add meaning to the word in important ways. Let's review some of our words focusing on the prefixes. Com or con means together. So when we compose something, we put different parts together to make a whole. O or ob means against, so your opponent is playing against you. Trans means across, so transportation means carrying things across a distance. X means out, so an export is something that is sent out of a country. Im or in means in, so an import is something that is brought into a country. Using the roots and prefixes we just discussed, let's try to use this strategy for guessing the meaning of a new word. Without using a dictionary, you can often make a good guess by using the roots and prefixes you see. Let's look at a word related to journalism. Expose. Imagine you read this sentence. Journalists sometimes work to expose corruption. And maybe you don't quite understand the word expose. Let's make a guess. You can break it into two parts. Out and place. If journalists expose corruption, they place it outside in a way where people can see it. So, you can make the guess that expose means to uncover something and place it where people can see it out in the open. Of course, there are many more useful roots and prefixes that can help you guess the meanings of new words. In this video, we looked at the roots pose and port and the prefixes com, o, trans, x, and im. If you remember these and learn even more, you will be able to guess the meaning of new vocabulary more easily.